Greetings homeschooling families, this is Joseph from Homeschooling Daddies and we are reviewing the curriculum for our son for the 2014-2015 to I mean, 2014-2015 school year and in this episode we're going to be reviewing what we're going to be doing for science. Um, now I just want to note that these that I'm showing you right now is just the textbooks that we're using. Um, as far as um, I haven't actually gone through him to make the lesson plans yet so um, once I do that then um, we're going to be purchasing all the things we're going to be needing to do science experiments and fun things like that so um, but this is the book that we're using it's basically the same book that the that he would have been using in public school if he had um, stayed there um, so um, it's pretty basic but it's interesting, but that's the hardback book that you're viewing right now. And then right there is the workbook. And then this is one of three um, teacher's manuals. We're still waiting for the other two. As you see, this is um, the Earth Science Edition, um, which are units C and D. Um, but let me go ahead and show you the table of contents for this book. Here in Unit A, it's life science, living things grow and change. Um, such as chapter one, plants grow and change. Chapter two, animals grow and change. And chapter three, people grow and change. And then Unit B, again, life science, homes for living things. Chapter one, habitats for plants and animals. Chapter two, changes in habitats. And then in Unit C is Earth Science, Exploring Earth's Surface. Chapter 1, Earth's Resources. And Chapter 2, Earth Long Ago. And then in Unit D, again, Earth Science, Space and Weather. Or Chapter 1, The Sun, The Moon, The Stars. And Chapter 2, Earth's Weather. In Unit E, Physical Science. Exploring Matter, Chapter 1, Observing and Measuring Matter, Chapter 2, Changes in Matter, and finally in Unit F, again Physical Science, Energy and Motion, Chapter 1, Forces and Motion, Chapter 2, Sound. So, this is the science book, and uh, we do have other, other um, books that we found that relate to the subjects in here that he will be learning that we found at like um, Value Village, Goodwill, and other thrift stores around the Seattle area. So um, so we can correlate those books with whatever he is learning. But like I said, um, once I go through this and make up a lesson plan and, and come up with it, whatever other stuff that we need to get, I'll go ahead and do a video on that to show you about the different experiments that we would be doing throughout the year. So, thank you for watching this, and um, check out our other videos. Bye.